quick video on how to make a protein shake. Um, on my channel, you guys have seen how I make my yogurt shake. If you haven't, look for it. Um, it's getting quite a few videos. But um, today I'm gonna make it differently. Um, is that a word differently? Today I'm gonna make it different. Um, I'll be making it with some protein powder. Everyone has a preference on their protein powder. Everyone uses a different one. Um, there's millions out there and a lot of times there's a lot of the same stuff. So what I'm gonna do is gonna show you the one I have. I have uh, Elite Dimatized XT. Got it from the vitamin shop. Um, tastes good and um, yeah, it's one that I can tolerate, the taste. So I've got this a couple times. What I'm gonna do is use that and then I'm gonna use, first of all, back up. This is my bulking shake, all right? Fall just started. Gonna be just bulking and, and uh, try to gain a lot of mass. You can make it low calorie too, but the peanut butter is what's gonna be the difference, okay? So I got two options for you. Um, here are the two options. Okay, so we got protein powder, banana, I'm going to be using egg whites, pasteurized egg whites, Costco ice. I have 100% uh, monohydrate creatine right there. I just, I've had this, I bought it. So what I do is I throw it in my shakes. Why not, right? It works. So, uh, and then you're gonna have the option for low, cal low calorie, which is gonna be lower fat, organic PB fit. You can buy this pretty much anywhere now. Big one, Costco. Actually, Walmart is a big one too. Um, um, Target, pretty much everywhere you're gonna find powdered peanut butter. And what, what it is is it's dried peanuts and uh, they extract the oil from it. And that's all the fat, right? The fat is in the oil. But today it's bulking time for me. So uh, I want the calories plus, you know, the oil, the fats in this make the shake taste a little bit better. So I'm going to be using regular natural peanut butter. And what else am I missing? Also Splenda to taste. Now I usually add Splenda just because it adds a little bit of a sweeter kick to it. Um, this is sweet, but it's not, uh, once it's mixed with the egg whites and the ice, and I think I do add a little bit of water just to make it, I mean, basically these are just like water, might as well use them to make it more liquefied, uh, but I do add a little bit of water sometimes. Um, peanut butter is a little bit salty, so I use Splenda just to balance out uh, the taste and make it a little bit sweeter for me. So you can do that to taste, you know, four Splendas, whatever, Stevia, whatever you want to use. Uh, yeah, so, Pretty much, this thing could be titled uh, Gorilla Juice, pretty much. All right, Gorilla Juice Monkey Shake. So, I'm gonna get to it, I'm gonna show you how I make it. Here it goes. Obviously, we're gonna start with the banana, and um, I'm not keeping track of macros, but when it comes to using servings for egg whites and peanut butter, um, and of course, to get the right amount of serving of the shake, um, I, I do weigh it out just to get the exact numbers. So, I'm gonna go ahead and add the banana first in your blender. Okay, so that banana weighs 128 grams. Cool. Cool story, bro. Uh, I'm gonna be adding about 192 um, grams of egg whites. I think that equals out to four servings. Then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use about two and a half servings of peanut butter. So one serving is 32 grams, gonna double that. 64 and then plus uh, half 32 which is 16 so let's see what that is okay so I changed my mind um, two servings exactly actually almost two servings 62 grams of peanut butter what I'm gonna do is add a teaspoon of creatine and this is a half a teaspoon so uh, I'm gonna actually use two of those to make one teaspoon reaching into the protein jug and I believe 34 grams is a scoop supposed to be so I'm gonna add that in there that is 38 grams so a little bit over a scoop um, I'm just gonna add a little bit more now remember guys you can add as many uh, grams of protein as you want I just did uh, 53 so I don't know it's uh, one and a half scoops all right so now I'm gonna add some ice and a little bit of water so there is my ice, that's how much I added right there. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start it up. And all the liquid I have in here so far is egg whites and there's totally not enough. So I'm gonna add some water as I blend it so I know exactly how much I wanna use. So here we go.
All right, guys, there it is. Now for the taste test. Yes. Okay, so I want you to try that with uh, whatever protein powder that you have and come back onto this video and comment below. You tell me what type of protein you used. Tell me everything that you put in it. You can add things to it, make it a vegetarian gorilla juice monkey, whatever you want to do. Throw some berries in there. Leave a comment. Let me know everything you did. Let me know what protein you used and how it tastes. And, uh, and I'll hit the thumbs up button to your comments. If you hit the thumbs up button to this video. All right guys, thanks for coming back.